What's up you guys, Martin here and welcome to Vlogtober Day 12. Alright you guys, so today we are doing uh, cooking with Martin. I know I haven't done this in a minute, but I like, when I find recipes I want that I like, I want to show to you guys. So today we are making KFC's Honey Barbecue Chicken Copycat Recipe. We made this the other day, a few days ago, and I was so mind blown. You guys, it literally tastes like the honey barbecue wings, those sticky wings you get at KFC. They have them as wings or they have them as chicken strips. Well, today we're doing chicken strips. I'm gonna show you guys the step-by-step -step process. I'm telling you right now, you're gonna wanna make this for friends and family and parties just to have. Either it be an appetizer or a family dinner. It is awesome. So first up, we are just gonna cut chicken breasts into strips like this. All right, just strips like this, you guys. This is all we're gonna do. I just put them in random sizes, it's fine. That's what we are doing first. On to the next step. Next step, you're gonna add two cups and three fourths cups of flour. You're gonna add a teaspoon of salt and a teaspoon of pepper to this mixture. All right, and you're just gonna mix this up really quick. All right, get that salt and pepper mixed in good. All right, you guys, so next up, you're gonna add a cup of buttermilk. I use Bulgarian cultured because I'm that bougie person, okay? I go Bulgarian. A cup of this in a separate bowl. They are wireless earbuds that were created by... After that step, you're gonna add heat to the oil. Go to medium high. You want the heat to be really hot. Okay, you want it to be able to fry good, okay? The temperature sh of the oil should be around 375, give and take. Just get that going. As soon as that's heating right now, next step to get your sauce ready. You might think, honey barbecue, that's all we're putting. No, there's more to this beautiful mixture. Let's get into it. All right, the first ingredient for this beautiful honey barbecue mixture is one cup of hickory brown sugar barbecue sauce. So we're gonna put one cup in. It's so crazy, because when I started making this, I thought this is all that you needed. No, you guys. This is a copycat recipe, and whoever copycatted this, it's amazing, okay? So one cup of the barbecue sauce. One fourth cup water. Next up, we're using two tablespoons of honey. One. And two. Next, we add one tablespoon of ketchup. And last but not least, we're gonna add one teaspoon of liquid smoke, okay? So I'm using a half teaspoon right now, so there's one half, and then the other. All right, so that's all combined. We're not gonna warm this up yet. We're gonna place it on the side. The oil is getting hot. Let's start the process. All right, so the first thing you're gonna do, you're gonna grab a chicken cut that you sliced. You're gonna roll it in flour. Okay, so it's all covered nicely, right there. Now you're gonna dunk it in the buttermilk. Okay, and now you're gonna add this back to the flour, roll it. Okay, and you're gonna place in the oil. Now I'm gonna do that with the rest of them. I'll be right back. All right guys, so as it's going, the trick is to have it golden brown on each side, okay? After that's done, you're gonna add your strip to the, to a plate, okay? And you're gonna do that until you finish all of your strips. Get the oven preheated at 350 as you're doing this, okay? So let me finish this. All right you guys, we're gonna check on these bad boys. See where we're at. Okay. 
see right there, that's the golden brown. So you're gonna do that with every single one. We're gonna get some magic going up in this kitchen, okay? It already smells bomb, so let's continue. And this is what I'm talking about, golden brown, you guys. That's how we want it. All right, so now I'm gonna start it. I already have a whole bunch going on. We're just gonna stir the ingredients for the barbecue sauce on a medium, on a low heat. Just let it simmer and cook slowly. All right, so when the sauce is done, after it's simmered a little bit, let it cool slightly before you start dunking the chicken in. But now, you're gonna grab a piece of chicken. You're gonna dunk it. You're gonna place it on the baking sheet. Just like that. I go like this so you can get all the coats. Okay. I'm gonna do that to every single one. Be right back. Alrighty guys, so there it is. These are majority of the chicken strips I made. They're all coated nice. They look delicious. And we're gonna place these in the oven right now for 20 minutes. All right. Yum. 20 minutes. And Babe right now is making these bomb fries. Yeah, these are really good. I really recommend them. If you guys have not had these Checkers Rayleigh's famous seasoned fries, get them. They're bomb, you guys. We, aren't they good? Yeah, we've tried uh, the Red Robins frozen. They were not good. Yeah. They had a weird aftertaste. Yeah, they did. And I do like their front and scissors. I do like the fries from like the, like the restaurant. Yeah. But the frozen one was not it. Nasty. Yeah, so um, it's good, you guys. This recipe, I'm not, I'm not even lying. I'm not trying to like hype something up that doesn't taste good. It really does. So it's my second time making this. Hopefully it tastes as good as the first time, or maybe even better. We will find out in 20 minutes. It is done. Here we go. Ow, oh, it's burning my eyeballs. Oh, yes. Oh my gosh. They look amazing. They look fantastic. Mm mm mm. Right, I'm gonna let these cool and then we're gonna taste test this. Uh, KFC's copycat honey barbecue chicken. This is its taste. Mm -hmm. Yep. Really good. That good. Mmm. -hmm. Mm. Finger looking good. Literally. Yeah, that's really good. Oh my god, it's so sweet. It has that like flaky crust that KFC has on their chicken. Mm. You can taste the honey too, they're a little sweet. And then it was like barbecue. Mm. It's really good, I like it so much. Yeah, yeah. so we're gonna tear up some, some chicken and some fries. Go ahead and try to make this. If you guys do decide to make it, leave a comment down below. Tell me how you thought of the recipe. Let us know how it tastes, mm. all right? That's gonna be it for today. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you guys like this video, please like, subscribe, favorite, share with your friends and family for more content. And until next time, you guys, don't be a lemon. Be a rosebud. Peace.